Hey, hey, you guys. I am back again with Spider-Man, and yeah, it didn't take so long to paint him up, and so the thing that took much time, more time was the base, I guess. But yeah, I haven't had time to make any videos the latest of days, so that's why it took a little longer. Uh, so let's have a look at Spider-Man then, shall we? Uh, yeah, he turned out quite okay. I think it was hard to do the red because of the black webbing that was going to be there. So... Uh, it was mostly like dry brushing for the red, so it would work with the webbing for the best uh, and the blue was kind of darkish that I did some highlight on and uh, washed and then did more highlights and so on so uh, toned it down with the wash uh, with the blue wash because the highlighting became quite light and yeah the base turned out okay, I guess, uh, with the, like, what do you call it, tile roof. Here is just a like, cut through on the building because, like, it, as I said, it, uh, as you know, it's not the whole building, it keeps on going. Uh, but it's just a cut through of the building. Uh, so yeah, quite fun model to paint. Uh, we'll see what I will do next. I am also going to show you uh, another miniature that I painted that went quite fast to do. He was, it is the weapons platform Hurley Force Edition Wars. And there you have his name. <laughs> and uh, yeah, turned out quite good went quite fast to paint him always a lighting lighting so so and yeah here we have like he's a hover or something like that so that is like pro probably like a power source of some kind that makes him hover and you see like yeah pretty much lights up all almost all the base of the base so quite nice model when you paint him up uh, so that is it for now guys we will see what the next uh, uh, project will be miniatures so yeah thank you for me and uh, have a good one